Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today we're tackling a common issue that many Vue.js developers encounter. Our viewer has a question about how to redirect users to a specific page when they navigate to the root path of their application. They want to ensure that when someone visits myapp.com, they are automatically redirected to myapp.com slash default view. However, they're currently facing a challenge where this redirection isn't working as expected, resulting in a 404 page not found error. Let's dive into the details and see how we can solve this problem together. Welcome back guys to another technical help question. I'll be going through the question, the answers, and hoping to help find that answer. Guys, I hope you stay crazy just a little bit like me and get through and work to the solution. Now let's get started. To address the issue of redirecting users to a default page when they navigate to the root path, we need to modify the routing configuration in your view router setup. In your current code, the redirect path is set incorrectly. Let's change the redirect path from slash default view to slash default view without the leading slash. Next, ensure that the child route for default view is correctly defined. The path should not have a leading slash as it is relative to the parent route. Finally, your updated routes should look like this. Make sure to test the application after making these changes to confirm that the redirect works as expected. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To resolve the default path issue in View Router, you can set up a redirect. This user demonstrates how to redirect the root path to the home component. In the code, the root path is redirected to slash home ensuring users land on the home component by default. The user also includes additional routes for live agent, bot, and user components, making navigation straightforward. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To redirect to a default path in View Router, you can simply use one line of code. Just add router.replace with your desired path. Here's the full code example. First, import view and router then define your routes and create a new router instance. Finally, don't forget to export your router instance. This setup will help you manage your routes effectively. And that's it guys. I hope the video has helped find you to that resolution and you are able to get through your problem. If you did, guys, please hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. It does help me out. And until next time, have a good one.